James Hardy offers two types of vertical wall shingle products, individual shingles and notched panels. Hardy shingle siding has the same warm, authentic, handcrafted look as cedar shingles, making it beautiful as a primary siding or as a complement to other styles of James Hardy siding. Hardy shingle notched panels speed up installation in larger areas. When installing Hardy Shingle individual or notched panels, a quarter inch thick by one and a quarter inch wide starter strip should be applied first. Then a nine and a quarter inch plank of Hardy plank should be applied flush with the starter strip. Now we're ready to start our application. Depending on the product selected, the maximum exposure will vary. Consult the product specific installation instructions for complete details. When installing individual shingles, be sure to vary the widths along the length of the wall. Shingle spacing should be a maximum one quarter inch apart, and you should leave a minimum lap of one and a half inches between joints in successive courses. Due to the overlapping of joints, caulk is not required except where shingles join trim boards, windows, and doors. If you're using a notched panel, trim the first panel to hit the furthest stud. Allow the trim panel an eighth of an inch from the trim board for caulk and secure above the keyways on 16 inch or 24 inch centers. Work across the wall allowing an eighth inch gap from the trim. Start the second course by removing the equivalent of one full stud cavity from the straight edge end. Save this piece for the other end of the wall. Secure the beginning panel leaving an eighth inch clearance from the trim board for caulking. Be sure to position your nails to penetrate through the previous course. If a course is broken by a window or doorway, it's very important to continue the application as if the wall were complete. Trimming for the opening and using the resulting piece may throw off the spacing above the break.